Hello YouTube, this is Dan with Point 50 Farms. This is a quick rabbit update here. Uh, I've got this little red New Zealand California cross that uh, when I was situating the animals the other day and, and separating them out, uh, I've got all of them into their separate cages now. Did a little bit of uh, work on the rabbits uh, this last weekend. And as I was doing that and separating the litters, uh, I found this little guy over over here uh, to have a little issue with his eye. Now, what I've been told by uh, one of my mentor ladies, that somebody that's mentoring me, uh, is it is possibly a nest box eye or conjunctivitis, you know, basically pink eye like what we have. So what I'm going to do here, uh, done a little bit of research, I've got... Uh... Alrighty, we're back here and I'm just going to show you the process I'm going to use to doctor this baby up here. Uh, first I think what we better do is I have a, a towel here. We're going to wrap the little guy up and, and restrain him a little bit because this can't be too comfortable if anybody's had pink eye before or whatnot. Uh, he might do a little kick and I don't really want to get scratched. So anyway, I've I've brought out just a bowl of warm water here, and I'm going to attempt to clean it up. Oh, yeah, we're going to soak this just a little bit here. Try to maintain this eye and just clean it up. Uh, it's a little bit crusty. This is one of my first cases here of, of this issue and I will uh, I'll get my nest boxes out before the spring the spring fling litter here and get them all all sanitized up better using some Lysol and or some mild bleach and get them dried out good. Yeah, that's, that's loosening it up a little bit. And to the best of my knowledge, this is, this is not contagious to humans, but I don't know that for sure. Uh, so we'll use sanitary practices, and as soon as I'm done here, I will be going inside and taking care of my hands, getting all cleaned up. Then I will come back out and feed the rest of them. I haven't had any problems with it. His litter mates. So we want to keep it that way. Find the medicine here. And what I do here, better get him restrained. Just like a little kid. Doesn't want to take his medicine. <laughs> Oh, that's already looking better getting it cleaned up. So, well, so far, so good. Get a few drops in there. Now it is uh, Tuesday afternoon and okay. I'm going to continue. I was told that it's a good idea to do this twice a day, but due to my work schedule, I'm usually doing all my chores but with a headlamp on, so I'm only going to do this once a day and I do the, do it for... Oh, we'll, we'll give it till the weekend and see if it starts clearing up. And if it isn't cleared up by the weekend, we'll assess the situation and uh, see how he's doing at that point. Anyway, uh, that's all I have right now. i got to get the rest of the chores done. 
and uh, I've got to haul some feed in and, and take care of the rest of them. I got water bottles thawing out in by the wood stove, and uh, got to haul some chicken feed and get it mixed up for the, the chickens. Anyway, uh, we'll uh, we'll see you later, subs.